Hello and welcome to uh, my new YouTube channel here. Uh, I just wanted to, uh, first off, let's um, introduce myself. My name is Tyler. Um, I'll be reviewing some products for us today. Um, I went ahead and purchased these because as you can see, trying to review products in this area, I don't have very good lighting. So what I wanted to do is um, upgrade my space here uh, with this whole uh, COVID thing going on. We've got a lot of live video streaming for work. Um, we've also got a lot of uh, uh, friends of ours uh, like to do a lot of music recording, things like that. So I'd like to set up a little area in this area that you see behind me and for me um, to be a better, better quality here. So um, what, I'm, what I'm doing here is I want to unbox something that I had purchased from Amazon. Um, paid $37 for this. Um, took a couple days to get here, maybe two, three days. Um, but what it is, it's called the Emart Photography LED Continuous Light Lamp. Um, the nice thing about these boxes, or this box, is it contains four. This package is for a, a package of four. Um, they are a light lamp that uh, it, 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 it's a 12, ED, 12 LED lights, um, and it's got a high output of 5500K. Um, which is very nice for um, just generic uh, photography. So let's take a look at what we have here. Um, I'm hoping that it can help me with my videos here. I've got a couple set up behind me, but I want to show you what's at least in the box. What we have in the box comes in a box about this size, Emart, right on it. Um, I've got a couple different packages. You get a, a blue option and, a, and an orange option. There's four of these, so a set of eight total. Um, and then I've already switched out this one over here which is blue this one over here is orange just so you can see the uh, color contrast and I've got the white caps that came out so you can just have the white LED light um, as well but there's again it's four individually packaged nicely wrapped no loose pieces whatsoever no broken pieces um, let's take a look excuse the noise we'll put that over there and right now um, it's tucked in nicely it's got a nice wrap it's got 110 out outlet for uh, for plugging just your normal plug um, looks like it's got a nice little you can see it's got like a nice grippy there which is nice when you can actually you know it'll 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 you can leave it loose but it'll still stay put to where you leave it and then if you do find the angle that you want to you just give it a tighten and it's not going anywhere so um, I mentioned before that you could change out the lenses this has a nice grip on the outside. Give it a little turn. Cap comes off. Piece comes out. You can see the 12 LED lights there uh, on display. So you have to be careful not to touch this part. But um, put the cap on. It looks like there's some fingerprints that need to come off anyway. But uh, we'll see how that looks with lighting. Um, and you'll notice this feature. How is this going to stand? Does it look like it needs to go on a tripod, mic stand, whatever? No. Um, what it has is it's got a cap on the end. And it's spring-loaded, which is really nice because that assists in getting the legs out. Once they come out, they snap. You can set it up on the desk just like this. Um, if, if you have more space, more coverage, and you're worried about them knocking over, there's an additional leg in here that flips out, and it'll give you an additional leg. You could probably also use it as a stake in the ground if you're using it outside. Um, whatever you may need to do there, but it is nicely made. It's not I mean that it's plastic and it's um, you know thin sheet metal But you know if you're not rough on this stuff, it should be just fine. So what I'm gonna do is Put this cap back on shove those legs in they're good to go crank this down tighten it tighten it up and It's in a nice little uh, Presentation there for you for travel so you can put them in a nice little bag or whatnot, but the on and off switch on off and, a, and a, a grip to help you with the adjustment. So I'm gonna put this one back in the box. And I'm gonna go ahead and plug these in because I've already got them on. And we will see how my lighting looks. So right now you can see this side I have a shadow, this side I have a spot. You can see my hands, you can see in my glasses, the reflection from my screen and from my window. Put this on, it, it, it just gives it a different feel, a different flavor. Now I'm using a Sunco HD action camera right now, so it's nothing special. Um, hopefully I can upgrade here in a little while, but um, you know, so it takes some glare and I can do some adjustments on the camera, but at least it gives it some pizzazz. You know, I'm in the middle of Michigan. Um, I'm an avid Tigers fan, so I've got the orange and the blue in the background. And um, you know, hopefully we can do that. So what I'll do is I will put a link in the description below 
uh, for the purchase of this on Amazon. I'm sure there's other locations that you can find this, but at Amazon, it was in Prime, free shipping, $36.99 for the set of four. Um, and I'll put some more information regarding this, uh, again, in the description below. So if you like what you see, hopefully I can continue to do some more. I know it's uh, getting started is a little tough, but if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button down below. And um, if you have any questions or concerns or anything that I can do better in this small little area, uh, just mention it down in the comments below as well. So again, hit that subscribe, hit that like, and I'll talk with you later.